this candlestick right here is an example of a spinning top candlestick. In this video, we are going to learn how they look, why they are important, and look at some examples. So yeah, guys, without further ado, let's jump right into the video. Alright, so first of all, let's take a look at how the spinning top candles actually look. So let's try to draw a spinning top candlestick right here. And what is special for these candlesticks is that we have a pretty short real body, but we have long shadows. So a spinning top looks something like this. So as you remember from a previous video, which I will link up in the corner in the eye if you want to learn more about the names I'm going to use in this video. But this large rectangle in the middle is what we call the real body. So this is the real this is the real body. And here we have the upper shadow. And here we have the lower shadow. Alright, and how do we know that we are talking about a spinning top candlestick? Well, spinning tops, first of all, they have a short real body. So let's write that down. So this part right here has to be short. And and the second thing about spinning tops is that the real body is centered between long upper and lower shadows. So as you can see here, the real the real body here is pretty much in the center of the upper and the lower shadow. And the real body doesn't have to be exactly in the center, but it has to be pretty close to the center in order to count as a spinning top. So this is basically how they look like. All right, so now let's take a look at what spinning top candlesticks actually mean or might indicate. And to do that, we are going to look at a chart here, an example. So let's take a look at the chart. This is an example. This is the gold chart in US dollars. But what we're going to look at, we are going to take a look at the spinning top we have here where we actually pretty much have two spinning tops right there and right there. And what can we see here? Well, before these two spinning tops occurred, we have we had a small rally here. We had long and strong green candles, which indicates a pretty one-sided price action. When we have price action to the upside, we usually call it bullish. So here we can say that we had a bullish price action. So we had a bullish price movement here and then the spinning tops occurred. And what does it mean that after a rally you see some spinning tops? Well, well, a spinning top indicates that the bulls or bears, in this case we are talking about the bulls, are losing momentum. So they are losing control over, over the price action to the upside. And in this case, this was, ac was actually confirmed one, two times here. We had two spinning tops. And then after that, we actually saw a huge, after that, we actually saw a huge drop here. And it's actually true that spinning tops might be a first clue that the price action will reverse. So we can write, it might be a first clue of a reversal, but you should never trade for a reversal only by seeing a spinning top. You always want confirmation that we are seeing a reversal before, before you take action. In this case, we actually got some form of confirmation on this day. We had two spinning tops and then we had a strong red candle here. And that indicates that the bears is back in control and that we might and that a price drop might be on the horizon. One important thing to learn here is that let me write it down here. We need more data to confirm a reversal. We can't just look at a spinning top and think the price will reverse. Oftentimes the price might go sideways or it might go sideways for a while and then continue to the upside. So you always want to look for a confirmation that the price is changing direction if you want to trade for a reversal. And yeah guys, I think that's pretty much it for this short video. If you found any help or value out of it, please consider dropping a like 
and if you guys want to see more videos similar to this one don't hesitate to subscribe and hit that notification bell i hope you guys have a great great day and i will hopefully catch you in the next video but for now take care guys ciao ciao